Hello guys, it's your boy Gaming Troll back again with another tutorial. So as you guys requested on Twitter, this is a tutorial how to make thumbnails. You guys seem to like the last tutorial how to edit videos and the PSD package for our Agario skins. And I want to say sorry for my bad English. I'm not the best on English, so uh, I'm gonna try my best. So open Photoshop, go to File New. This is the best size for a thumbnail. It doesn't take a lot of space, so you can upload it. Uh, 1280 by 720 okay uh, so alt and scroll to zoom out and up uh, now we're gonna go to open again and all the links are on the description for all these packages so I'm gonna open the packages the PSDs I mean so we're going back we're gonna start with the leaderboard so this is a leaderboard you can change everything on this leaderboard the number the names the colors everything this is you're free to do whatever you want so I'm gonna go to crystal and sorry crystal but I'm gonna put my name I'm gonna put KME troll as a number one and we're gonna close the group like that and click hold click and move it to our thumbnail like this now we're gonna hide it for now we're not, we don't, uh, we're not using it I'm gonna put it on red to remember uh, I'm gonna close it from here I don't use it reflection so this is a reflection you may see it on other videos thumbnails or other youtubers so I'm just gonna drag it to to this control T just to see where it is it and I'm gonna put it here because it has the same color of the background like this and hide it too and I'm gonna close it too from here player template so this one you can use it but uh, you don't have to if you have my skin package you don't need this one but uh, I will put it anyway so it's a player name like this you can change the name you can put whatever I'm gonna put for example Titan uh, the skin you can put any skin you want so I'm gonna go to to our thumbnail I uh, our thumbnail pack I'm gonna pick for example a skin okay let's use this one the background just a background put it here this is our skin so we're gonna move it down like this okay press hold alt the alt button it's close to your space button so alt and click alt and click on this image like this when you press alt you will have this arrow like this and click now it's under the circle so if we if we move this it's, it will stay in a circle like this Control G I'm gonna make it like that and here we go so now we're gonna select the first layer and shift and select the last layer to select all the layers between right click and convert to smart object like this and use your mouse and drag it to your thumbnail here we go this is our skin but I repeat you don't have to do this if you have my skin package that I'm gonna open again you don't have to use this so we're gonna close it now you don't need it so I'm gonna delete it so I'm gonna went back to the thumbnail pack so the thumbnail pack have uh, Agayo uh, leaderboard the black one and the white one a virus a mother cell extra have explosion you can use for thumbnail uh, explosion again for a pop split uh, a fire for like a split a trick split I don't know why did I put this and this is for a pop split uh, eyes you can add to your agario cell eyes this one poker um, what's this name uh, palm face I don't know and uh, this face these eyes I mean this one <laughs> kawaii this one and last this one funny faces there's a lot of funny faces I'm gonna select all of them you can, you can do whatever you want this one the Harry Potter one I don't know uh, memes there's yeah, you know the memes so there's a lot of memes uh, so let's hide them now go back to our thumbnail we go I'm gonna open my skin package okay it's loading 
it has all the Agario skins if you if you watch it during my last video I'm gonna put the link on the description so I'm gonna I'm gonna pick some skins from here this is my skin so I'm gonna use this one uh, let's add three or more three more skins uh, Okay, let's use this one, convert, and let's choose this one, yeah, this one, okay, now I don't need, okay, I will need also a lighting, so I'm going to click on lighting and just click whatever you want and drag it to your layer. Now we're going to close skin, we don't need this anymore, so this is our thumbnail. Okay, now we're going back to Agario. I'm gonna pick the the black Agario background and a virus. That's all what I need. So this two, control and select them. If you want to, to select them both, control and select them. So if, for example, if you select this and you say, uh, control and select this, it will say it to, if you control, no, if you click on this one and shift and click on the other one, it's, it will select all this layer between, so like this. So for now, I need only the black background and uh, the virus. So I'm gonna move it here to our background. So the background is gonna go down like this. Um, Alt and uh, and uh, like zoom out, uh, scroll out to zoom out. Control and I'm gonna make it small like this. I'm gonna drag it like that. Hold shift when you when you change the size. If not, it will be it will go like this. So if you hold shift, it will go like this, um, like that. We're gonna lock this one because I'm not gonna use it. I'm gonna I'm not gonna move it anymore. I don't need this. What is this? So this is the leaderboard. Okay. This is the reflection, as you can see. Uh, this is our skins, and the lighting is gonna be up. And this is the verse. So now I'm gonna click. Auto select so I can select anything I want from my lead uh, from my um, thumbnail without clicking. So I'm gonna select the virus, control T, shift, and scroll down like this just to change the size. Like that. I'm gonna make another virus here for I'm gonna do a pop split thumbnail. So I'm gonna put this virus here and another one here. Okay, so I don't need this skins for now so I'm gonna use for example only this one just for now I'm gonna control T drag it like shift and drag it like that I'm gonna put it here okay now let's make it a little bit bigger like that I'm gonna hold alt and click and drag to make a copy alt and click and drag to make another copy so click on the, the middle one control T again so the pop split is gonna be a small this one is a smallest piece this one is bigger and this one is the biggest one so shift again and make this one bigger uh, smaller smaller than this one and this one is going to be the smallest one like this it's like a split so this uh, the big the biggest cell must be on top of the smallest one so let's see this one is going to be on top and this one is going to be on top just like this the virus must be down so we're gonna put the virus here I'm gonna select all these links this one and this one and this one okay you click you shift okay click on this one click again on this one and click again on this one to select all these layers now I'm gonna press Control G Control G to group them okay now we're gonna use the second skin this one Control, uh, let's go to this skin, Control G. We're gonna put it here. I'm gonna put it under uh, here for a pop split, like that. I'm gonna put some pieces to make it look like a pop split, like that. Another, another Alt and drag for a copy again. So like this. So this is like a pop split. Uh, now what we need to do is again. Select all these layers, Control G. This is the other pack of skins, uh, of uh, yeah, of the enemy. I mean, 
so uh, what we need to do is this skin control T this is a random player for example just put it like here and yeah so now we're gonna go back to this folder press alt and drag it down with your mouse to make a copy right click convert to smart object we're going to filter blur and motion blur to add a motion like we split it so we're gonna add a motion blur like this let's see like this okay now we're going back to the, the first one this one make a, again the same uh, as the other one a copy right click and convert it to smart object we're going to filter blur and this time i'm gonna go with radial blur to make it a pop split so i'm gonna add a zoom with a 75 amount like this maybe that's too much let's go back to radial and i'm gonna add 50 like this okay that's good and hide it now we're going back to the first package we right click blending option struck 5 pixel and I'm gonna pick this color from this skin so far so good uh, I need to make this a little bit bigger so I'm gonna move the virus here this package and this package so I'm gonna select group 3 with a copy of group 3 this is the the radio again so and this is the kraken skin and this is the fast mo uh, the motion blur I'm gonna select all these layers that we copied control T okay and drag it like this that's too much okay this like this to make it bigger like that now I'm going back to this layer I believe it's this one no 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 yeah this one no we, uh, I, I didn't check auto select because it's a group so it keeps selecting the group so this one I'm gonna drag it like this from the okay now what we're gonna do is we're going to the leaderboard we're gonna put the leaderboard on the top like this we're gonna drag it up control G and move it like this make it bigger and put it here now we're gonna add some arrows for a clickbait so I'm gonna click on this right click line tool click on this setting check start 400 by 400 the weight is going to be 35 fill it with a red color and stroke it with a white color the size of the stroke must be 5 or 4 that's your choice and I'm going to add a arrow here and arrow here and where is the, where is the virus so I need to go back to the virus let's see where is the virus uh okay we're going down so this and this okay i see the virus so i'm gonna move the virus down like this and uh, we check again auto select select this arrow control g and warp zoom in to see and we're gonna move this up up this up and this up like this to give it a sharp a sharp uh, arrow so so far so good now we're going to light I'm gonna add this light I'm gonna move it with my mouse like this and I'm gonna go to the reflection I'm gonna drag it up put it on top like this and activate the reflection put it under 
the light like this and change the opacity to 85 um, so that's so far so good I guess that's a good thumbnail that's have some clickbait it's a cool thumbnail if you want more tutorials a part two how to make channel arts or something like that I don't know put in the comments below what you want this is a basic thumbnail it's good and uh, all the links again are on the description you can uh, download all the packages that I made so that's all for today bye guys peace